in an effort to increase transparency. Like a lot of cities post George Floyd, we had some struggles with policing. Modesto City Council members voted to approve a community police review board and an independent police auditor to review officer activities and address them with the police chief. Completely different perspectives on policing. This means that a nine member board will review officer activities related to use of force complaints, in custody deaths, officer involved shootings and bias based policing complaints, among other closed investigations. More interaction with the community is in government period, whether it's the police, whether it's um, economic development, no matter what it is, is better. Our tax dollars go in their budget. I pay you to protect us, not to kill us. Brittany Chavez, wife of Paul Chavez, who died in an officer involved shooting on July 14th, is hopeful that this will better the police department. I would like to see real honest people, just real honest people, someone who's not afraid to speak up, someone who is going to have our communities back. The committee will be made up of Modesto City residents who represent different gender, sexual orientation and ethnicity, among other qualifications. The police have to interact with all the different segments of our community. And so having everybody representative means uh, we're going to have uh, a good conduit into all the different parts of our community. The Modesto Police Officers Association told KCRA that they were involved since the beginning of this process and support the change. The Community Police Review Board members will serve four-year terms and applications for the nine positions open up in January. In Modesto, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRA 3 News. There will also be random selection of one-third citizen complaints.